For a diesel 8V71, uh, there's a lot of damaged components. It's been sitting in uh, basically a junkyard for a long time. So we're just taking it apart for certain components that we can rebuild. Uh, and and some of them we sell new, so we're not we're not taking all of them. But right now we're removing the oil pump. The service manual says that you need to drain the oil and remove the, and remove the, uh, the oil pan. And that's because this, this part right here, you see this? This is what sucks up the oil from the oil pan that's connected to the pump and that's also screwed onto there. We uh, lifted the engine up a little bit to, to get to the oil pan and drain out the oil. I'll remove that hose there. So this is the aluminum oil pan, not the cast iron one. So if you hear it like this, it's pretty, uh, pretty light. It's kind of bent up. You hear it from being on the ground. Oil pan. And uh, the pan was kind of like this, it's like round. The bolts are out of this oil pan. It's pretty rusted, so it's going to take a little bit of whacking to separate it here. And it comes off. Here's the inside. You can see the, the crankshaft. First manual it says before you take out the oil pump to replace it, you're going to need to to drain the oil. Uh, one of the other things is this, this little component here is actually connected to the oil pump, so you can't remove it before you take that off. So it picks up all the oil from the, the oil pan itself and sucks it back into the engine. These two pieces here are the oil regulator valves. So now we're starting to remove the, uh, the oil pump. And the mounts. That helps you mount the engine to the to the boat. Getting uh, separating the oil pump itself here. So, of course, as the name says, the oil pump is what what uh, lubricates. The engine, this thing pumps all the oil. You saw that piece inside the oil pump earlier that sucks up all the oil from the inside, and then this spreads it throughout the entire engine to lubricate it. Alright, so we've got both the engine mounts off, and now we have the oil pump free. So if, if you were had a running engine, now this engine has a lot more problems than, than maybe your engine has over there, but once you once you take this off, you can you can put a new one on. We sell rebuilt ones. Remember, this is what sucks the oil up from the oil pan when it's connected to the oil pump. In this case, we're not reusing that, so that's why it's okay.